Welcome. In 2017, the world marks the 40th anniversary of the late Egyptian president Anwar Sadat shocking and inspiring trip to Jerusalem and his historic speech where he proposed ending 30 years of war between his country and the state of Israel. President Sadat's historic visit to Israel in 1977 was the first ever by an Arab leader and the foundation for the lasting peace between the Arab Republic of Egypt and the State of Israel. This visit was all the more courageous given the opposition and outrage he faced at the time. In three days and one year from today, on September 17th, Egyptian President Anwar Sadat, Israeli Prime Minister Menachem Begin signed the Camp David Accords in 1978. It will be 40 years. In 2018, the world will mark the 40th anniversary of the signing of the Camp David Accords by Egyptian President Anwar Sadat and Israeli Prime Minister Menachem Begin. 2018 will also celebrate the centennial of Anwar Sadat's birth. As these two milestones coincide, Senators Orrin Hatch and Senator Ben Cardin, along with U.S. Representatives Chris Stewart and Grace Meng, introduced the Anwar Sadat Centennial Act. Today we gather to acknowledge the efforts of Congress, and we also acknowledge the efforts of the many distinguished members of the staff to these members of Congress who help and are helping pass, hopefully pass, this important legislation. Welcome, Congressman Kennedy, to my right. This luncheon is dedicated in memory of the late Dove Lautner, founder of Delta Galil, and we are indeed honored that we have with us here this afternoon Mr. Isaac Dava, the CEO of Delta Galil. Thank you very much for coming. Anwar Sadat fought for peace and paid the ultimate price. In honoring Anwar Sadat, we honor a man who truly embodied the statesmanship and fortitude necessary to bring peace to the Middle East, virtues that are as important today as they were then. I'd like to acknowledge our worthy co-chairs, Rabbi Eli Abadi, the, the spiritual leader of the Sephardic community in greater New York City, Mr. Andrew Friedman, Fire Commissioner of Los Angeles, <laughs> Mr. Leon Goldenberg, Chairman of Shalom Torah Centers, Mr. Stanley Tritel, Co-Chairman of the Wallenberg Commission, Mr. Jack Avital, President of the Sephardic Syrian Community of Brooklyn. <laughs> Mr. Aubrey Sharfman, Masora Heritage Foundation Board of Trustees, also from Los Angeles. <laughs> Dr. David Moskowitz, President of the Endowment for Democracy in Eastern Europe. <laughs> and I'd also like to acknowledge Mr. Saul Goldner, who will be joining us soon, and also two individuals who could not make it here today, Gloria and Harvey Cayley. Thank you very much for your support.